what's good what's good what's good lovely soul empress here coming to do gemini's august love reading all right um just a couple quick quick things um i've started my patreon so if you want to get the extendeds for the readings you can join the patreon and the link will be in the description box or you can email me at lovely soul at gmail.com with the title of the extended that you're looking for you pay five dollars and 55 cents to either um cash sign lovely soul empress at cash app or um at lovely soul at paypal okay so um also if you'd like to book a personal you can do so you'll find my website in the description box all right so let's get into your pre-shuffle you got the queen of cups okay so cancer pisces and scorpio could be of importance okay then you got the moon which is cancer now this could have something to do with your mom okay because that moon energy with the queen of cups uh, is giving me maternal energy or you could be a mom all right you also got the lovers that's your card gemini all right you may be needing to make a choice regarding love okay open for love in reverse so you may be looking reflecting at uh the relationship that you had growing up and how that affects your present relationships that could be happening you got past life okay um so um you also got giving a gift and twin flame so i feel like there could have been a split or some kind of challenge that's triggering something from your childhood or something like that or some kind of deep emotion all right i feel like the reason why this is affecting you so deeply is because this could probably be your twin flame okay you also got escapade all right so you may be going away away or going on a vacation or somebody could have done that all right um but i feel like this could be you getting away to try to process the situation and you got community all right so uh you could be an activist or you could be doing something for your community maybe that's why you're traveling i'm not sure but i feel the energy of like uh, maternal energy here all right so let's let's talk about your pre-shuffle i mean your oracles you got communicate clearly all right, so I feel like you need to, because that moon can talk about your deepest, you know, desires or a secret or something, right? You got the good kind, okay? And I feel like spirit is telling you, you know, that you are a person that works out of light. And that they want you to stay that way. You got creator of alchemy. I feel like you're manifesting. You may not realize you're manifesting. I feel like you're manifesting the good kind, okay? And then shift the way to new potential. So I feel like there's been some, for many of you, it feels like there has been an awakening of some sort of your intuition, of some type of energy that is putting you in contact with the mother, the divine, all right? Now we're gonna... um do a celtic spread we're going to get right into it spirit can you talk, show me the situation for my gemini gang for august one card spirit thank you can you show me what is in the blockage for my gemini gang thank you can you show me what's at the foundation for gemini this one hit first thank you can you show me the energy that's falling away for my gemini gang Thank you. Can you show me what's crowning Gemini right now, spirit? Thank you. Can you show me what's coming into Gemini? Thank you. Can you show me how Gemini sees themselves, spirit? Thank you. Can you show me how others see Gemini? Thank you. Can you show me what's in Gemini's hopes and fears? Thank you. And can you show me the most likely outcome, Spirit? Okay, I'll take these two together. Thank you. And you got the Six of Swords at the bottom of the deck. So you are moving to calmer waters. It may not feel like that to you, but you are, okay? So now you got the Ten of Wands at the situation. So you're feeling burdened. You may have a lot of responsibilities both at home and at work. Page of Cups, I feel like somebody could be apologizing to you as well. Um, Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. But this is also like, you could be finding or feeling like you're too busy for love. I also feel like 
you're passionate about something. Could have something to do with children or community, like doing activism. But I feel like you're very busy. Somebody could be trying to offer you a cup of love, right? You've got um, strength in uh, the blockage. This is the card of Leo. You could be dealing with a Leo. But you might feel like you don't have enough strength to deal with a situation or like somebody doesn't. And if you're dealing with a Leo, they feel equally as burdened as you. Okay, I feel like maybe it's two people with very hectic uh, schedules, page of swords. You may feel blocked from each other uh, right now, okay? I feel like maybe you're both singularly focused on other things. Okay, you got temperance at the foundation. Okay, this is Sagittarius. It could be a Sagittarius of importance. But you've got... Um, temperance with the death card so somebody wants a new beginning something's coming into balance i feel like spirit is bringing some changes you got the death card which is scorpio this is talking about death and transformation so out of this uh whatever spirit's bringing to you some type of balance some type of favor um i feel like somebody also wants to begin again with you okay three of wands i feel like uh you could be waiting on this person or they're waiting on you i feel like you have a new perspective on what you want for the future with this three of wands now you got the king of pentacles and the energy that's falling away that's taurus virgo capricorn okay let me get one more Okay, so I feel like you could have handled the situation in a very reserved manner, um, wise, okay? Um, you could be very good with money, or this person is. I'm getting a little bit of like, um, not a firm, I don't want to say a firm hand, but I feel like not a non-emotional hand. You could feel like this person that you're dealing with, they have trouble... Um, meeting you halfway chariot spirit why is this chariot here it crossed why spirit so i feel like this person has trouble um you know like i said meeting you halfway i feel like they want to be the head the emperor um and it feels like you guys just can't meet in the middle and this feels like a betrayal to you in some way you also could have found out that this person traveled somewhere okay and you know like maybe they went on a trip they told you they were going to do one thing but they did another ten of swords okay now you got the world as to what's crowning you this is some type of ending this also can be like an online fingerprint strength card in reverse okay there could be an ending because of a situation where somebody couldn't risk temptation okay um or they couldn't like withstand the temptation this again could be a leo this world card is Aquarius, Leo, Scorpio, and Taurus. Now you got the four of pentacles as to the energy that's coming in towards you. So uh, you could be holding back, which I really do feel that because you had the, what was it? Uh, love, uh, open for love in reverse with the four of wands. So I feel like there's something to do with your home life. You could live with this person, could be married, or maybe there was some talk of that, but you could be holding back. Maybe this person's telling you, let's let's kind of um, make this more solid between us because they did something that you know led to some type of burden, but I feel like you could be holding back from this, okay? And I did say I was getting emperor energy and there it is, all right? So, um, the hermit is crossed here, spirit. Why, um, does Gemini see themselves as the hermit crossed? So you could feel like you're forced into some type of isolation in some way. Maybe you feel like there's a separation that you didn't want. Six of cups, okay? Um, or you might feel like you need some time to go within and this person could be saying, let's get back together. I do feel like there's a lot of love here because you got the ace of cups. People see you as the ace of wands reverse, some type of loss of passion. Spirit, why? Page of swords. Okay. Um, so let me get one more. 
So this person could feel like you've lost the passion for them because you're into other things, okay? Page of Swords, they feel energetically blocked from you too, but this Three of Pentacles is here. They do want to collaborate with you. You got the Ten of Swords in your hopes and fears. So I feel like you're afraid that if this person betrayed you, that they would do it again. I also feel like there could have been a betrayal of some type of relationship in the past. It could have been a family relationship. It could have been, you know, you could have been married before, anything like that. Okay. And then you've got um, the Queen of Swords. This is you, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. You're using discernment, okay, to avoid you know, um, being betrayed again, but, um, it's stemming from your fears, devil card here, Capricorn could be a Capricorn of importance. Okay. I feel like this person, if like, if they're a Leo, they might have a Capricorn moon, but either way, um, this person, like you're afraid that you'll get hurt by them. And so you're letting your fears dictate, um, what you do. Right? So this is why you got open for love in reverse. So spirit is saying you don't have to be with this person, but don't close your heart chakra. Now the nine of swords is here with the seven of wands for the most likely outcome. So the nine of swords here, sleepless nights and anxiety. Okay. Um, I feel like you're going to be coming out of that because you have the six of swords here. Now there's a tower here. Okay. So I feel like something is being torn down. Something surprising. Okay, you might feel relief by this with that Six of Swords, Seven of Wands. Okay, these could be the walls between you. <sighs> okay, so the Seven of Wands, this is you, you know, or them being defensive. But I feel like this is you more so like uh, protecting yourself, putting up healthy boundaries. Here's the hermit. Now it's in the upright before it was crossed. There may be some energy of you like taking stock of something and realizing like, you know, you don't have to deal with something and going within. Okay. Five of swords. You might have felt like somebody was trying to win at any cost. Spirit is also cautioning you to make sure that you're not the one trying to win at any cost, you know, pulling yourself away to prove a point, okay? Because remember, you have this devil card here, so you want to be careful that you're not responding out of fear. Now, the six of swords is the overall energy spirit. Why? Knight of pentacles. So you were waiting on something and you got tired of it. I feel like you're making a move. Okay, magician, you're going after the things that you want. Okay, you did get a creator of alchemy, you're manifesting something. And here's the emperor, high priestess. I feel like this emperor is going to try to come back into you. They could have had some sneaky energy with that magician card. The high priestess is here. I feel like you know that they're coming back. Okay, page of pentacles. They're going to offer you something tangible and they see you as the empress. Okay, so uh, let's look at if there's anything else that spirit wants to tell us about this situation spirit you want to show me what else is going on here so this person wants to negotiate with you in some capacity says negotiator bargaining begging this person i feel like they wish they hadn't went about something because i feel like that king of pentacles was non non-expressive with their emotions but there's an interview talk conversation get on the same page i feel like that's what they want okay i feel like they're missing you incredibly with this insatiable card all right uh spirit can you show me who's involved in this situation can we get some more details uh privileged lady okay i feel like that's you okay uh you got the journey card here i feel like there's uh you did get the escapade or something like that yeah so i feel like you're on a journey right now this could be you know a, a journey within all right for self-expression or to create something with that alchemy card spirit what should my gemini's be working on right now friendship courage Pride, okay? Make sure you don't make your decisions out of pride, but I feel like that's that king of pentacles over there, all right? Spirit is saying have the courage to go after the things you want, 
All right, friendship, you may be using this time. I told you this escapade could be you going away with your friends, like trying to get, you know, maybe your mojo back. All right. Um, yeah, so let's clarify this privileged lady. And then we're going to go into the extended spirit. Why is this privileged lady here? Ten of Pentacles. I mean, Ten of Cups. Okay, so they see you as the happy life, happy wife, happy family. And that's what they'd like to repair now. And then that's going to be up to you. So in the extended, um, if you're joining me in the extended, we're going to look at how they really feel about you, what their true intentions are, um, what can't they see, what they're currently going through. And the most likely outcome so if this is where we part ways thank you for spending time with me and for those of you i'll meet you over at the extended okay i'm wishing y'all light and love and blessings on blessings namaste